Uh, so both uh, Milan clubs were held on Friday night, Gab, ahead of their Champions League clashes this week. Who looked the better, you know, Inter everybody, or Milan? I, I, look, there's gnashing of teeth, pulling of hair. Oh, we're dropping points. Yes, it's important for the table. I'll give you that. I thought both teams created a ton of chances. What was different, Inter were beaten by a worldy, an improbable worldy from former Inter player Candreva uh, in the 90th minute. Didn't that mean hurts. It. But they missed a million chances before that. Uh, Milan also, Impoli had zero shots at all in the game until like the 80th minute. Uh, they created chances. I'm okay with that heading into the Champions League. Uh, a Palo de Bala penalty uh, gives Roma an early lead away to Torino. They never looked back as they won one nil gap. Jose Mourinho third in the table. Respect. 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 So, yeah, look, uh, you can't argue with the results. They've got a big Europa League coming up uh, in, in midweek. He, 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 he made a bunch of changes, rested a bunch of players, so from Pellegrini to uh, both Tammy and Belotti were out for this game. It's all downhill. You get an early penalty. Torino, I don't think, are a great side. And then mm. they just kind of manage it through. But there's a skill in that, too. And, like, Mourinho's not going to win points for style, even though sometimes he would like to. Um, so didn't judge him by results. This is an objectively good result to be third. Even yeah. if Juve gets a point back, you're still in the Champions League. It puts pressure on others. He's got the whole city behind or the whole red and yellow half of the city behind yeah. him. he got the fans with him. I don't think there's anything more you can you can ask for. Mm-hmm. Now, if you avoid if you avoid a good, having little back and forth with retired ex pros like Antonio Cassano who make fun <laughs> of him, that might be good. But whatever, he That's likes that shock, side of it? things it's too. A shock, isn't it? Cassano having an opinion on something. Yeah, no, he says, he says Mourinho's I... too cinematic. <laughs> whatever. <laughs> Let's go back to Friday night and Napoli's two one win at Lecce. Don, they weren't super impressive, and Gio Simeone picked up an injury. But Victor Seaman could be back for the Champions League. And that's a game changer, right? It's a massive game changer. That is a game changer in a half. They've not been the same without him the last couple of weeks. Sure, they sort of survived early on when Raspadori and Samione was, were, was, were getting their goals. But he's a beast. He sets the tone. He closes people down. Um, I think what I've seen in the, in the last couple of games, especially in the defeat against Milan, is they didn't have that presence. Osman puts defenders under pressure. He sets the tone. The midfield players, have, and then you know about his ability. You know yeah. how good he is with his scoring goals. He's had an ability. He's a hold-up player. How athletic he is. He's a he's a he's a and, massive game changer for them. And now he has his new mask after losing his old one. Ah, yeah, right, yeah. Um, the special custom-made mask. They said it was a lucky mask. It's more than lucky, as I said before. It's like, it's, like, it's like Tony Stark and Iron Man, right? He has no powers without his mask. Exactly. But put the mask on. And he becomes so. What's he got? Play his mask for life? I think he will. I, mean, I, I for ju- Come on! I, I genuinely look. He got injured like like a year, like more like a year ago. So we're going to we're going like. to I, I genuinely say awesome man playing with a mask till he's thirty five. Look, I don't know for a fact, but I genuinely. But like he must have healed, right? I genuinely don't believe that he wears the mask because for for a medical reason at this point. I mean, maybe well, I'm. I think not. that's the only reason, though. No, I, I think he wears it because. What well, he thinks he looks cool. Well, he lucky. does look cool. Does he look looks cool. cool with a mask. Definitely. He's playing the best football of his life. Footballers are superstitious. Definitely. You know that, yeah. right? You were telling you were telling me the point of the, the, the story about when you went on that win streak where, with, with Everton and you, you didn't change your underpants oh, for, for months. So, two and a half years never changed my underpants. <laughs> <laughs> Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.